truth is the daughter of the peaceful heaven and shuns contention and the tumult of the passions but to him who can deny himself and love her with undivided heart she turns aside visits him by night as he sleeps and makes his face and his whole frame to rejoice the spirit of religion dwells not in the vessels of dogmatism exists not in the children of unbelief nor in the degenerate sons and whitewashed sepulchres of belief it is little to be extorted by luxuriant and brilliant leaps of reason or by formal orthodoxy and monarchism and for children whose hearts are to be rendered better by religion the simplest and most forcible expressions are surely the best standing by the fountain why should i not drink of it by so doing i am at least secured from the impurities of the bucket honor to the man to the nation of men zealous and strict for their religion but it is nevertheless reasonable to investigate before displaying anger when we reach yonder world when we enter the society of heaven's radiant denizens who are all of one mind and friends how well it will be with us and how we shall regret that we spent so much time here quarrelling and perhaps acting unjustly in our strife that was written by matthias claudius seventeen forty to eighteen fifteen holy roman empire from his anonymously published a disputation between messieurs w and x and a stranger concerning alberti's heterodoxy